Welcome back to Shooting Gallery New England, everybody. My name's Joe, and today we're gonna be finishing the We The People 2020 build. That's right. Let's get down to the tabletop, and I'm gonna show you how to install this. All right, guys, so let's pull this over here. Oh, look at that. Now you don't even see my table. That looks even more professional. So we are at the end of the first round of build series on the We The People 2020 build. Again, this is very basic, but that's right, guys. I was feeling kind of cute, so I figured, hey, why don't we put an SB Tactical Brace on there to get all you trolls saying, you're going to go to jail, shall not be infringed. Abolish the ATF. Oh my god, if we could get that tr uh, comment trend going down in the comment sections, please, I'd love it. I need some entertainment in my life. So guys, this is literally the simplest install, but for those there who have searched how to install these stocks, I hope this video can help you. This is the SB Tactical SBA3 Pistol Stabilizing Brace. I got it in black to match everything. Uh, to be quite honest, I'm telling you right now, I already took the ubiquitous sticker out of the box and I put it on my Nintendo Switch. This is the SB Tactical SBA3. It comes with a QD. Looks like it comes with a QD uh, socket in the back, which we're going to actually put a sling on this on this uh, pistol. It has a buffer tube in it. I'm taking that out because I'm not going to need it. Well, I could need it down the road. Who knows? Alright, so I took that off. Now... This is how simple it is, guys. For those who have never really worked on ARs and you're like, how am I supposed to do this? Your stock is usually gonna be the easiest part. This has a six position buffer tube. This is supposed to fit over a mil-spec buffer tube. Now, this is what we're gonna do. Now we're at a wall. You're gonna take the adjustable part and we're gonna pull it all the way down, move it forward, and guys, That's essentially easy as that. This is, again, the SBA3 Stabilizing Pistol Brace. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Let's get back up top and close this video out. <sighs> Guys, ain't this the best day of my life? We have the complete pistol lower. That's gonna take some time to, uh, I'd say, break in, but that thing looks dope AF. That's what it looks like from the rear. That's where you're supposed to strap it around and you can shoot your AR pistol like this. Guys, just give us a little bit of time coming up with this build. I know we're literally just waiting on parts and you know funds. I don't really have sponsors for this build series. We kind of have a sponsor, but it's more just a company that's willing to help out a little bit sourcing parts. I'm gonna get to that later on in the build series. But guys, this is essentially all set. Again, I know in the first like two videos, I didn't use a armorer's wrench to tighten down the castle nut. If it makes you guys feel any better, I tightened it when I got to work the next morning and I had to replace the D10 springs that I messed up. So I hopefully you guys don't catch me on that. But this lower receiver is all set. Now, later on in the series, I'm gonna explain on all the legalities and would you, should you type deals when it comes to pistol braces and AR pistols. That'll be a separate video in this playlist. So like this entire series before guys, please make sure you're commenting below. Let me know what you think of this series. Also make sure you're smashing the like button. If you're not subscribed, make sure you're subscribed. We're having a 500 subscriber giveaway. And once we get to 500 subscribers, one lucky person is gonna get some dope stuff. If you guys want any of the stuff you see in this video, Please follow the very first link in the description and it will follow you to a separate page where this video is being posted or a blog post where you can get links to all the products and tools that we're using in this build series. Thank you so much for watching today, guys. Stay shooting and I'll see you soon. Peace!